What's up everybody, my name is Titan Sage, welcome back with another video, and uh, I don't think I've, no, I haven't showed my uh, Clash of Clans build yet, so I mean, I'm just gonna jump right into it. Uh, this is the current setup I have for my nighttime village, if you're aware of what that is. If you do not know what this game is, this video is gonna make no sense. Either go download the app yourself and play, and you or watch some other videos on what the game's about, and you'll see how awesome it is if you like gaming. If you ha do play it, then I mean, I don't know, this is just it. Uh, you're probably immediately going to notice that they are in two separate things, and the same thing is with my daytime village also, but I'll explain that in a second. I'm not like other people, that's <laughs> pretty much it. But this setup is the fucking bomb diggity, like, you may, yeah I know no one uses that word anymore, uh, you may judge it at first because, you know, well, the weaponry's been separating us and there's not as much firepower in one area. You're wrong. You are wrong. You want to know why? Because now, because this little setup here, you see this? Either they attack, they normally attack both of these things, right? Because the more upgraded, the more they get scared of it, you know, seeing it like they're okay, that's pretty tough, and they want to attack it, right? And if you haven't noticed yet, yeah, that's that's pretty scary. All this stuff, it's uh, not nice. And then other times, the only next most common play attack place is right here. So just two giant bombs, literally. If they try to do that. And ironically, nowhere else is almost ever attacked. And when it is attacked, it doesn't really raise much of, raise much of an issue. Over here, it's a mortar and two cannons. And I mean, there's nothing to be said. The stuff surrounding basically protects these cannons and this. And then, yes, obviously, you have some air support right here. And that's why these are turned on smaller, so they basically work as the automatic air support. You know, it's in the, with the zappy thing, too. They're just fine. No, the zappy thing, the hidden Tesla. Especially combined with that, so this is fun on air support if you're wondering. So uh, let's punch in. And then, yeah, I didn't know what to do with these, so literally they're spread out to make it harder for them to get 100%. If they do manage, also this, if they do manage to, you know, push through my defenses. So I guess I'll just showcase uh, me battling, and then I'll show my uh, daytime village and uh, see how it turns out. If I fail, uh, this is gonna be really uh, ironic, but yeah. Okay. Ooh, lucky his mortar's being worked on. What should I do here? Should I use these even? I'm not sure. Yes, my army's boosted. It works very well. Okay, do not judge me. Let me see. Uh, I think I'm just gonna go with cannon parts this time around. I think that's like maybe, my, it's probably my best plan of action here. Just, yeah, randomly placing them with no tactics. I'm gonna guess it is and turn it down a little bit. Okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna speed this and show you guys what it will really know what happens. Well damn. There we go. That's <laughs> Yeah, I don't know if we beat that. Let's uh, let's see how we did. Come on, internet. What's wrong with you? Why are you not working? Well, my internet's terrible. That's why. Okay. Uh. All right. Now let's see how we did it. I guarantee he attacked the areas I said he would, because they always do. Let's see. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm just assuming. Well, no, he doesn't have archers, so maybe not. Maybe he actually went for a different attack plan. Okay, what you gonna do, buddy? Okay, oh, okay, I, the irony is a bitch. He didn't attack any area I thought he would at all. Like, he literally attacked in the least commonly attacked place. This is not very bad level stuff. Level 11, uh, Barbarians, level 4, and I've level 3. Hammer Guy, I nicknamed him the Hammer Guy, and I, I've now forgotten his real name. Oh, damn. Okay, so... It's looking like he's gonna push through our main defense. Okay, he, he didn't actually. Oh, he got attacked over here and I didn't notice. Yeah, he barely made it through the wall. If you didn't notice, also, I leveled up the crap out of my wall to make it very difficult for them to even get in. So you've gotta push through, manage to push through our walls. And even if after you get through those, these are all gonna be a distraction if we're really in a post, just an extra, you know, troop distraction. And while you're trying to get through the walls, you're gonna have a mortar on your ass. And then these, you know, 
beastie cannons. I leveled him up, and I'm trying to get him leveled up now. It's 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 a pretty beasty combination. And then this tactic over here almost always works. And as you saw, they still couldn't even get through all of it. Like it, it's it's a good setup. There's nothing I would really want to change about it. Honestly, there's leveling up's only the next thing to come. And uh, I guess I'll show you my daytime village now. Yeah, you're probably going to wonder immediately why everything is shoved into a corner. This is all the stuff that I did not really need. And if I could have stored in, let's say, a chest, the majority of it would have would have left this out. I would have left the stuff that I need to access a lot more, like this. And, like, you know, the clan castle and, like, the brewing stuff. Like, oh, some of these things. But, like, I would literally have put away all of these. I would have, like, I wish you didn't even need to have the camps out. But if I did, I would obviously you know, need to leave them out. But I wish I could just get rid of the rest of the defenses because I don't even need them. And I know you're thinking, this is even worse than my nighttime village. Hey, you should definitely be using all of your defenses. Oh, shut up. No, I don't. I have developed a perfect plan that is perfect. I have, if you didn't notice, it's actually a perfect thing. So this is the upgrade cannon. I know it's different a little bit. Why did I click on that? But see, cannon at the end, then the wizard tower. And I know the wizard towers are very low level, but shh, don't judge me. The archer towers, then air defense, then two more cannons two more archer towers and then one main cannon where i'm trying to level up right now that's going to be in the center which is going to be the op cannon over here then this is that's actually my favorite area but yeah and then we have the wall surrounding it the same kind of tactic is in my nighttime village we have stuff surrounding basically to protect like as a barrier this has air defenses lining around it bombs lining around it bombs and traps on the inside everywhere like if there's nothing safe about in here we have the expo set for not just ground for air and ground and four hidden Teslas, and I am trying to make these beastie hidden Teslas. Like right now we have two of them upgrading to level uh, four and then one that's still level three. And you know, it's basically just to protect this. You will not believe how many attempts I've had at people just trying to get in to this thing, just to, you know, prove a point. Like so many people that have failed. So don't get me wrong, there are people who have definitely succeeded. Why is that there? But there's also definitely a lot of people who have failed, you know, who just can't seem to manage to get in. And I'm not sure why they're doing it. I literally, my best guess is they're trying to prove a point like, aha, you thought you could protect your stupid thing. I just got in anyway. And then they, they're not able to. But I mean, either way, they, they tend to get pretty damn close to it. Like, it, it's hard, you know, to get in but there's people who have destroyed me with things like dragons are probably my biggest problem but let me show you i believe it was who had the dragon this guy i'm pretty sure it might be it might have been him who attacked and it was actually pretty damn difficult to deal with so like because of my mind stuff in the zap my zappy's hidden tesla it's uh pretty hard to you know screw it now they're called i can call them zappies dragons they don't live too long but they they cause a big enough problem where i'm like come on see how long it takes to kill them and then you can rage them and i don't think he managed to actually you know he does yeah see what i mean and then he doesn't attack anything else he just does that to prove a point like haha i can kill your uh, base that you're trying to protect take that <laughs> Once I level them up, though, those were lower levels. Once, he wasn't even at this level yet. Once I get, like, these all leveled up, it'll be a beast thing. And I just been doing it for fun, uh, to be honest. I, this is just, you know, it's more of a fun setup, not like a forced setup to make myself win always. Because I don't care as much about, like, the winning factor. I mean, I still do want to win, don't get me wrong. But, I mean, I'm just doing it for fun. You know, it's, I'm not going to be able to enjoy myself as much as I, I'm just putting myself through, like, the whole... Oh, man, we gotta make sure this set is perfect and we can never lose, like, blah, blah, blah. I don't care, really. So, uh, since it seems like uh, this video isn't too long, still, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, do at least one more battle. Just, you know, show you guys uh, my awesome skills in Clash of Clans. Hold up, what happened? Where'd they all go? I didn't even see what happened. What happened? I gotta see what happened to my troops over there. I thought that would have worked better. Okay, guys, level 12 barbarians suck. I take it back. What happened? Over here. Jeez, what What did I do wrong? Where did it go wrong? It, it clearly went terribly wrong. All right, here it is. What happens? The fucking mortar, huh? No, it was that thing. Damn it, dude. Two things just ruined my original tactic with archers. 
this thing, the mortar, and this thing. And then, yeah, we already know I die the rest. Okay. If he didn't win, I'm going to be very shocked. He should absolutely be able to win. Yeah, Builder Hall Destroy. Fuck. You didn't see shit. Nope, that never happened. Never happened. That battle didn't exist. This setup is the bomb diggity. And whatever you think you saw, you didn't see. So we're going to do one more battle to prove my point. I should just use the stupid cannons. What, what am I doing? What's up, guys? We're back with our second battle. Our second battle, not fourth. Okay, it's not our fourth. This is our second battle, and uh, we're gonna be using that same tactic we used that other time. You know, the uh, cannon one, because it works uh, better than any of the other setups that I didn't try, because uh, those battles never happened. All right, so let's uh, let's just, uh, jump into this, I guess. Or maybe you think I should use anything else. No, what am I, who am I kidding? What am I gonna do? Let's just do this. What am I, let's just do this. That didn't exist. I'm not really focusing, guys. That's my problem here, okay? Just to let you know, those two other battles that, you know, didn't exist, I wasn't really focusing on them uh, on purpose. Because I, I wanted to show what it's like when someone loses. Okay. Okay, yeah, he's a... What a noob. He can barely even get through my wall. Why are you guys attacking the one area I said people never attack? Are you trying to mock me? Like, the game knows it, and they're like, ah, oh, we're gonna fucking match with people who are gonna attack that side of your wall. I just know it. It's the game's fault. Ahaha, ah, I still won. What a noob, am I right? You, you can't ch challenge me. What a joke, am I right? All right, guys. That's going to be the end of this video. Sorry, I know you want to see more of me playing this game. Really awesome and stuff. But I know, I've got to go. So if you enjoyed it, just go ahead and smash that like button. Smash it, just literally fucking obliterate it. And then, uh, high fives all around. <laughs> no, I'm not going to go there. I'm not going to be that cringy. <laughs> okay, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye